eccentric Chinese warlord, Zhang Zongchang, displayed his fearlessness by sitting in his own coffin and smoking a cigar. <laughs> what resource problem did he have when he promoted his entire army and how was it solved? I'll say that one more time. The eccentric Chinese warlord, Zhang Zongchang, displayed his fearlessness by sitting in his own coffin and smoking a cigar. What resource problem did he have when he promoted his entire army and how was it solved? He didn't have enough cigars, cigars for right. them to smoke in the coffins. <laughs> They were all like, we're doing that too. That was yep. badass. That was, that was banging. <laughs> Let's have more of that. Yep. Okay. Resource prop. Every word of that, Caroline, was not what I was expecting the next Wasn't one Wasn't it a to delightful be. one? Thank you so much, Arwood, for that question. How does smoking in your coffin as an eccentric warlord solve this resource problem? Sorry, he promoted his entire army. His entire army, yes. And just to be clear, this is promoted in the terms of increasing their rank and not just giving them some advertising. It is in terms of increasing their okay. rank, yes. That he didn't have enough medals for them. Rank pips, stripes, something like that. Ella, you're spot on. Yeah. So yeah, it is because they didn't have enough medals. Okay. To be promoted, what does that have to do with smoking in a coffin? Is that, that's relevant, right? I assume. That's such a good question, Tom. Oh. oh. Was that just a cool fact that you wanted to tell us? <laughs> <laughs> so oh. the resource problem is the medal. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. What could possibly be used to replace that? Or what could be used to fill in that gap in the resources? Gold coins, chocolate coins. Coffin linings. Mm -hmm. Um, no, uh, a more how sensible how many, suggestion than chocolate coins, Ella. How many cigars <laughs> you have you can smoke is, is your rank. You just get one of those <laughs> cigar cutters and cut the cigar into many, many circles. And oh, I'm sorry. Hold on. This might be too eccentric, but could they like burn you with the cigar? Oh, Maybe no. Like a rank I'm horrified okay, and in I'm love sorry. with that suggestion. <laughs> <laughs> they're, they're eccentric. And they're an eccentric warlord. Is it is it to do with the the coffin stuff then? The coffin stuff is less relevant. The cigar stuff, on the other hand, <laughs> the num yeah the number of cigars in your lapel. <laughs> no. How can you make medals or make something that stands in for a medal using a cigar or using a lighter or using something that will leave you with a thing you can give out as a medal? I. Is it a physical thing or did they just like trust each other? <laughs> They're like, he's so cool. I trust him to know. He, he probably knows. Look at him. He's, he's in his own coffin. They definitely were not trusting each other here. Okay. They, they needed those medals. Wait, so they got the medals? Did they steal the me did they steal the medals from like graves or something? Dead people. No once again, it's not <laughs> dead people. Why do I say it in such an excited voice? Dead people. Yay, dead oh, people. Yay. Uh, occasionally on the show, people come up with taglines by accident and lateral. It's not dead people. Isn't that <laughs> <laughs> uh, want that shirt? Um medals. I feel like I've pulled my weight in this question. Tom's <laughs> get in there. <laughs> Wait a minute. How big was this army? Is this like uh, four people or is this? <laughs> <laughs> no, it was a considerably sized okay. army. And he's got to give all of them Could a medal. there have been like a... Is, also, is, is this something like... Um, uh, like violent happening is the answer, or is it more on the like resource management answer? It's like nothing. Nobody was getting like stabbed or killed or maimed okay. or marked in any way. Tom, okay, get okay, the okay, get okay. It, get the branding thing out of your head <laughs> for this one. <laughs> yeah. Okay, because I was thinking maybe you just like kill like a bunch of the people, then you have right. enough medals. But it but it's just a resource thing. Oh, yeah. The issue was probably that they weren't killing people here just throwing that curveball in what? Uh, oh, what? <laughs> sorry is the answer dead people in that he just killed some of the army no once again S no Tom, dead stop people trying to steal my answer <laughs> <laughs> is it um so cigarettes were pretty commonly smoked among his armies 
Is it like what you could smoke determined your rank? Oh, yeah. Cigars could be... Oh. Uh, okay. Oh, that's a really good suggestion. Did cigarette packets used to come with something that could be used as a medal, like the, like the? Oh my god, the foil from cigarette packets! Yeah, they use that to make medals. <laughs> oh my god, they have foil medals. Yeah, you are absolutely spot on there. Well done, Ella. Pulling the weight of everybody. I know my chocolate <laughs> coin medal thing wasn't that wasn't far that off, silly. right? I had I had to put it down because you got the first part of it so quickly that it was like, <laughs> no, we can't, we can't have this. We've got to. <laughs> but yeah, you are absolutely spot on. They ran out of rank stars or medals because every time that Zhang Zongchang defeated a rival, he would absorb the troops of that rival oh. into his own ranks, oh. allowing them to keep his ranks. But in order to like prevent rebellion from his own soldiers, everybody in his army would get promoted. Okay. Meaning that they didn't have enough of these medals or stars. Um, and because smoking was so prevalent among Chinese soldiers, they used the silver and gold paper inside of cigarettes to make these stars, basically. Oh, oh dear. dear. This is a really fun fact. Um, many of the officers would notice that their rank, their prize, their medal uh, would not even survive until the end of the promotion ceremony. So because oh. it was made out of these really thin papers, it would disintegrate. 